and do a little review on one of the ultimate um, limited edition toys out there. Moon Landing Michelangelo. Very rare, very expensive, but like I said, if you go to a swap meet, it's going to be cheap. And I got this for two bucks. Um, I've seen one on eBay, it's like, what, 50 bucks, uh, 20 bucks out of package if you're lucky. Um, the only difference I don't have on this one, it didn't come with his back, you know, the little backpack for his face thing. Um, it's supposed to come with a flag, and it's supposed to come with a footprint where, you know, he's supposed to stand on. Um, they all come with different things all for the turtles, and you're supposed to combine them together. Kind of like that whole NECA um, turtle toys, how you make the streets together. Well, it's the same thing with these, but it's more about space. So, we're going to talk about this bad boy right here. And I hope you enjoy this review. As you may see, he's winking at you. My girlfriend thought he was missing an eyeball, but until we get closer to it. I just could not believe I found this. And his little sticker right here, Apollo 11, I don't know if you see that. Front cover of him. His moon boots. American flag. Pretty sure some of you already know the whole history behind Paul 11. And I don't want to bore you by telling the history. So, he does this routine, you know, the whole head look back, back and forth thing. Oh, just his head been back there. And his arms. Uh, does a whole up and down thing hand moves like with something down. I'm trying to be really careful because it's very kind of shaking and I don't want to break it so I put in a little zip out bag and hang them on a wall where you nobody messes with it and yeah supposed to come with this little helmet you know to break a breathe in space but it didn't come with it but I'm just looking enough I have this alright as you may see there's a hole right here it's supposed to be like his oxygen tank tube goes around to his side and into his backpack that he's supposed to have back here, his oxygen tank, tank when he goes out in space. <laughs> um, this is the 25th anniversary of Apollo 11. Like I said, I don't want to tell you too much history. If you want to know more about it, just, you know, look at the line Apollo 11 to know more stuff about it. Um, just probably to represent them. Each of them have different faces, different things to come with each other. So, yeah, if you see, like, Don Tello's face, it's kind of freaky looking. So yes, add this to your collection. This is one of the highest limited edition toys out there. Uh, it might not cost too much if you don't have the full um, backpack and all the other good stuff. But if you do have it, that's great. But still, it's still worth something even though you don't have the stuff. So, if you have them in the box, they're going to probably come with a booklet. Some of them comes with coins. So check that out. Um... The other thing is, do not smoke around your toys, please. I, I'm telling you straight out because not only the box, but the toys uh, on this part turns yellow. It kind of like a brownish, like poop color. So take care of your toys. Stop smoking around your stuff. You gotta smoke while smoke outside, not near your collection, or else it will be ruined. So that's my little review on this. Um, yes, you have to get these. If you see any of these ones like this kind, not the whole um, like that one review I did with the. Oh, the Raphael one, the space one. Yes, yeah, that's worth something right there. But if the if it's not Apollo 11, it won't be expensive as these. Or worth a lot more than these. Um, get all four of them. There's no shredders, no B-ball rock thing on them. Just the four turtles. So get this to your collection. Oh, and the other thing is, if uh, we go to the swamp meet and all that, do not wear your Ninja Turtle t-shirts. He's like, hey, look at represent them. Don't. Because any of those people see that shirt that says Ninja Turtles or the faces, they're going to price it up and rip you off. So, you know, play dumb with these people. Um, if you see something like, like this, don't go, ah! You know, don't get all like, oh, you're all excited because you've been looking for it. Because if they see that, like I said, they will price up the money and make you pay more. So act like it's nothing, act like it's not worth anything, act like you don't even know what the hell you're you know, buying and play stupid with these people and it will give you like, say like a dollar for each of these expensive turtle toys. So remember, play smart, be safe, 
don't get rip off and take care of yourself everyone happy hunting everyone bye it's time for ebay villains this guy of course the same dude selling a foot soldier out of his package for twenty two dollars and three fifty five yeah okay so I added uh, with my foot soldiers I got right here and let's see so if I use if I bought stuff from him I would have spent that much right there for all five foot soldiers but really I spent what I spent for a, a dollar each plus one which I actually got it when it first came out it will come out as nine dollars so I actually you know shop smarter than people who probably shop from this guy so like I said this guy is, is pricing every Ninja Turtle stuff totally up the ass so stay away from this guy warn people do not buy from this guy because you know he's like I said he rips people off left and right especially you had to put shipping and handling it's gonna pay twenty two dollars for a small action figure like this Mine comes with weapons too, but come on people, please. Stay away from this guy.